Hello Earth Signs, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for tuning in to your current energy love reading. We'll be looking at your recent past, your present and your future um, in regards to where you are currently in your love life. So if you enjoy this content, please like, share and subscribe. Um, otherwise, let's lay out some cards here. Um, for your recent past, Page of Swords, the Chariot, Eight of Cups, your present, and your future. Okay, so in the recent past, you had the Eight of Cups, the Chariot, and Page of Swords. Okay, so I feel like the past is coming back up or a past person has um, has been around you in your recent past, someone that you still have had some sort of attachment to. The moon has come up twice, so there's a strong cancer that's coming up in the cards here. Um, I feel like the Eight of Cups, you have left a situation or you've left a person behind and you've sort of disconnected. Um, but I feel like you haven't entirely cut that cord, Earth Signs. I feel like this might have been, even in the distant past, even even though we're looking at recent, it could be more distant, like a more distant connection. But I feel like something that you walked away from because you didn't think would work or you felt like something was missing, um, I feel like there's regret coming up around that situation. Now, maybe on your end, it could be on your person's end as well. I'm seeing that there is someone that you have left behind. Um, this person is still thinking about you or is still hoping to reconnect. So what we have here is, is I feel like you can't tie yourself away from a recent past situation. You're still thinking about it assessing the situation, thinking what you could have said or done differently, Earth Signs. You haven't moved away, you haven't disconnected mentally. Um, I also feel like this could be for your person as well, that moon energy. I feel like the recent past is still very much a part of your person's or that person's energy. Get an, I get a sense where you guys left each other, something wasn't working. Um, but I don't think you've, you've found the fulfillment you're wanting or leaving them wasn't like the problem. You finally realize, you know, being with them wasn't the problem. It's, it's something else. You thought it was them, um, but I think it's something else. Um, it's a destined connection, I feel, with the stars in the canopy of the chariot. Okay, if we look into your present energy, there's the confusion or the uncertainty. Again, we've got the moon, so this could be divine feminine. It could be cancer energy. Um, either way, what we're seeing here is this what we're seeing here is this confusion. Okay, so you may want to be friends with this person. They may return and they want to be friends with you. We've got Pisces energy, so strong water energy um, recently and presently. Um, and I feel like with the Three of Cups, someone wants to be friends again. Um, the reason they're telling you that or the reason you want to be friends with this person that you've left, if it's an ex or something, is because there's feelings still there, even if it's on a subconscious level and you're not realizing it there's feelings there you obviously still want to be in touch you obviously or they they're obviously still wanting connection so they can keep in touch with your life they can be updated with what's going on with you and if you haven't left entirely and you guys are still friends then you haven't really left their life entirely then they're not feeling the loss as much as they would if you were no longer in contact or have agreed to remain friends Hmm. So that's quite interesting. 
I feel like there's a bit of fantasy going on or expectations. Um, presently, you're expecting this person to reach out. I mean, Earth signs, you could be the one that has blocked them, the one that has rejected their calls, the one that has said no to the relationship, the one that's set, like cut the cord. Um, and maybe now you want to be friends. But listen to that subconscious energy, read into it, tap into it, because it's trying to tell you something about the way you feel about this person. Okay. Um, yeah, and I feel like with the Three of Cups, it's it's... I mean, it could be a good energy. It could be like you want to be civil again, especially if you guys haven't spoken in a, in a long while and you sort of want to reconnect. I think it's it's possible that there's friendly fire happening, yes, at the same time. But I also feel like there's still emotion uh, from your side or emotion from their side. So I don't, I don't think that has left you uh, entirely um, or has left them entirely. I feel like... I do feel like some of you, it could be unrealistic to be friends with this person so soon, especially if things did end and you guys did leave each other in that recent past. I feel like it can be a bit unrealistic and someone would be like, what? You know, you're expecting us to be friends after that? Like, you've got some nerve to do that. Like, be prepared for that friendly fire um, is what I'm seeing. Um, let's look at the future here. Okay, the future holds a lot of options, um, I feel, with the two of wands. So there's options. There's potentially another love connection that's coming in around you, possibly with a foreign lover or someone you've met online or at a distance. Um, I feel like things could go either way, but Earth signs, you've come up as the Virgo here, as the Hermit, which is a figure of solitude. So Earth signs, I actually feel like your future is seeing you move away from this connection um your future is like you being wanting space wanting independence or being single it's a figure of solitude um it's also that virgo energy so there is communication i feel either way you've got the queen of swords that supports this so you will speak again you will resolve the issues you will talk about what you can't talk about right now you'll be able to in the future so that's a good sign but i also feel like you're going to distance yourself from them in the future maybe that's what you need to do but the future is is telling me you're going to have other options around you i don't know if you're necessarily going to take those other options earth sign because earth signs because you'll want to be alone you'll need time to think and reflect um but i feel like you may be on speaking terms once again so even though you may face that friendly fire with them just know in the future feelings change things change you know people come around anger subsides they've had more time to process and and um, register what's happened and sort of put things into perspective and that's what the hermit does so I feel like you need to you know if you're wanting to reconnect with them you need to give them time you need to also give yourself time um, and that's going to help you resolve things but I actually see you wanting to be on your own or there's a message here that you need to be on your own um, and maybe even talk to other people just as a distraction maybe that's going to be the factor that helps you process everything that's happened here i will leave it at that earth sign so thank you again so so much for tuning in um don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel um other, otherwise we will be in touch again very soon so thank you so much earth signs and bye for now